Okay, so that was the the webcam test. Coming in for blitz right here. Come on. Oh, you can't see him. But oh, it's that's blitz. So I actually found a webcam. It actually records audio better than better than my gaming headset does. Look, he's even bolted it. When I first found it. It was like this. I was like, I can't see, but I figured out you can turn the knob and focus it. Look at that. Look at how focused that is. You can even see my crippling acne now. Now that I have a working webcam, we can really get these videos started. I have tons of games that I have already. I have tons of games that I've downloaded, tons of scary games that I'm ready to play. But first of all, we are going to finish Spooky's Jump Scare Mansion with what should be the final part. So what is going on, everyone? Supergonk64 here. And once again, I am so excited that I that I actually got a webcam working. Now I'm like an, now I'm like an a actual YouTuber. Of course, we are going to be finishing up the game. Spooky's Jump Scare Mansion. Let's just hope my save didn't get deleted. No, it didn't. We're back here at room 500. I feel like we were further, but... Oh, well. What's that? You know, I hate to... I hate to be awkward enough already, but I'm gonna go get a chair. <laughs> Sorry about that, boys. Okay, I didn't I didn't break my PC doing that, thank god. I feel like if I turn the lights off it's gonna be Can you still see my face if I turn the lights off? Yeah you can from the glow the glow of the TV. I think this is what Markiplier used in his first few videos. His voice used to sound different in some of his older videos. Because he was using webcam, so this is how Markiplier got that sound and buzz in the background to some of his old videos. It's pretty cool. Those old Markiplier videos where he just uses a webcam are pretty nostalgic. Why is the music getting scarier? There we go. Oh yeah, we're back here at the express tunnel. I remember that's where we were. Sorry it took a couple days to get this uploaded, but you know, now that I have a webcam, I got no excuse to not be cranking out more of these videos. I've been working ahead of my college homework, and after I fail all of my exams, I should have the whole summer to being able to upload videos every day. Then my six subscribers We'll be able to enjoy some more of my videos. I'm pretty sure I have like six subscribers right now. You know, you gotta start somewhere. Oh, it's this guy. This guy's this guy's not so bad. If it was the puppet, I would I would have lost my shit. Excuse me, that's that's very rude. The deers, because they will just attack you anyway. Just run past the front. Bitch, 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 get in the. Okay. Like, even if you kill them with the axe, they still manage to get a hit in on you. Fuck! Get ready to meet the deer god. He's not going to be too happy that I killed some deer.
I don't like that. So. Did I come from there or there? I came from here. No, I have to find a key somewhere. And then the deer god is gonna be after me. Actually, a little bit nervous about the deer god. I don't remember if he was difficult or not. I think he was not as difficult as the puppet man, but still pretty terrifying. Here he comes. Where are you? There you are. You little bastard. Let's get a good look at him. Look at you. Aren't you horrifying? Get through the door, please. Thank you. Like, they always come out when you don't expect it, like in the middle of a chase scene. What? He just said my flesh would sustain his children. I don't remember him talking. It's, it's been a while since I've seen a playthrough of this. Like, I didn't watch any playthroughs after I got to the deer part. Yeah, you, you didn't scare me that time. The deer is pretty easy to deal with. I mean, like, it's just as easy to run from as anyone else. Well, except he floats, so if you get to one of those rooms... Like you know which ones I'm talking about. He can just float over the gaps in the floor. A3, yeah. The notes are just repeating themselves now. I don't... I guess I could have looked at the entry for the deer god, but I kind of already know all the monsters in this game. And we're almost at room 600. We are making great time, so... F Get out of here. Get! Um, thank you. <laughs> better ingredients, better pasta. That's the power of Home Depot. Damn right it is. Let's get another one of those Resident Evil doors. Sorry, just scratching my ass. I gotta remember now that I'm on camera. These rooms are new. I don't really remember these rooms. It's a cool texture. Oh, we gotta run now. This, the goopy guy's not so bad. Like, why is my face like so itchy? <clears throat> oh, it's locked. Can we get him with the axe? Oh! Fuck, he's behind me. I was not expecting that. No. I would not like to enable sticky keys. They should give me a monster at about room 10. Please don't let it be the puppet man. Please. Please. Anybody for the puppet man. I'll take anybody for the puppet man. Oh, the, the space monster. Yeah, I'll take that over to the puppet man. This part's pretty cool as far as like dead space.
Check this out. Oh, the doors are open. I like that door opening sound. It, it's cool. So apparently this is the old GL Labs. This is not an alien spacecraft. It's like this big... Like, it kind of looks like John Carpenter's The Thing. It's like this shape-shifting monstrosity. Just wait till you see it. If you haven't seen it before, you're in for a treat. If you have... You know exactly what I'm talking about. It's... It's coming soon. Spooky just said that there were things that needed to salvage from this place. I'm starting to worry that a loose specimen may be included. And a list of things for us to retrieve. The power just shut off again. What is wrong with everything here? You have to keep it close because... Oh yeah, that's right. You can't just outrun it. Stop it! If you get too far away from it, then it, uh... Runs after you. But if I keep it close, it kills me. So what, what, what am I supposed to do? You can't keep it close, you can't run away. What, 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 what am I to do? I actually don't remember how I got away from this monster the last time I played this game. That's too cl You're not gonna get me again. Get away from me! Is it close enough? I'm gonna keep it close. I'm gonna make sure I can see it before I go into the next room. That should be keeping it close enough. Watch me get the goddamn sticky keys. Too close. Um. Okay, this this is legitimately good monster. Whoa, don't, don't you get speed boosts? Now, you, now, you, now it feels like you're too slow. If I get a goddamn locked door, I'm dead. Dead. Get 
too far away, I mean. <clears throat> Round the corner. Uh, oh, okay. My little buddy, he's following me. Don't get sticky keys. Don't get sticky keys. Whoa, 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 no, 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 no. You see, that's why this guy reminds me of the thing. Okay, so when he does that animation, you're too close. Come on. Come on. Okay. Okay. This way, please. Okay. For a second, friend. No, 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 it's in the endless. That's not fair! That's not fair! I thought I was gonna get killed by Specimen 9. I thought it was one of those hallways. It's like that one meme. Panic, panic, calm. Wait! Okay, because he, he immediately comes into the room after me. So you just take this one room at a time. If he turns into a worm, you might be close enough to a door that you can just outrun it. I'm taking a chance. God. I got you, you stupid ass. It's another one of the same rooms, okay. No, you, you can't get me. No, no. No! Would like to get to room 700, please. Please! Please let me make it to another checkpoint. This guy is on my ass. I'm not kidding. He's...
This is the second worst monster to Puppet Man. But he's still loads better than Puppet Man. It's not even creepy, it's just like weird. Oh my god. He should leave me alone at 600. Oh, he, he left me alone. I was gonna say, he's gonna leave me alone at 650. But he's already left me alone, so I'm good. This is, okay, so it's not the same thing as Specimen 9. 93 fatalities, only effective on subjects of past trauma or history of psychological issues. I wish it would keep me on page 2. Dear God, floating figure appeared in the test chamber, believed to be unusually violent here, engulfs and absorbs subjects, extremely effective on violent subjects. So yeah, if you're violent, you've killed a deer. He, he comes after you. Specimen 10, a worm-like creature that inhabits the old run-down geo labs. Extremely violent. It was a modified yield to be extremely violent, but it was passive. Though not effective, it was kept as a pet until the fact it was abandoned. And this is specimen 9, but it's it's a glitch. It won't, it won't let you see it. Um, to take the dead, take the dead, take the dead. Skull-shaped like plays. The subjects were taken. So yeah, that's the big bad. That's the final boss. Here's what we'll be facing next. Oh, that's the same thing. Form-changing creature believed to be extraterrestrial. Oh, so the eel was friendly, but this guy was taking the shape of the eel. Okay. And then I think next is Burger King Satan. Right? Yeah. Floating red figure found inside a secret area below a large man. Victims vanish on contact with a specimen found inside the testing chamber days later. Proof not effective as victims' souls do not remain empty. I didn't really pay attention to what I was reading. I just glossed over it. that game. You can do it. We can help. Papa John's. What? Well, I'm going against the fast food demon next, anyway. Hundred percent beef. So I don't know, like they make the meat out of like satanic cows or something? It's weird. You gotta go in the woman's restroom. The bloodstained one, of course, now it's locked. Oh, the key there it is. Okay. Key picked up. There's notes uh, somewhere. There's something like someone was working here and they're like. I was anxious getting a job here at first, but it seems like things are getting better. This chain is really expanding, which is a shock, because just last week I heard this company was going broke. Every day, more and more people show up to eat here. Something still sets me up about this place. And it's... It's it's food, though, so I'm going to try and not eat anything from here. Today was a weird day. The average number of orders continues to rise as it's been. I don't know about the number of people. Today I saw someone use the drive through and order a lot of food for one person. And then, ten minutes later, they were back and ordered the exact same meals. And they left again. And another ten minutes, they were back again. Maybe they're just delivering food to a party. But it's, it's, it's gotta be like some sort of satanic ritual. I mean, who else orders McDonald's Big Macs that often? You 
you gotta go in the ball pit. Or not the ball pit, the, the play place. Can you even go on the men's? No, it's broken. That's broken. You can't go in here. This is gonna be so much fun. This is like a linear path, it's not even a fun maze. This is one of my favorite areas of the game. If I die and have to come back here again, it wouldn't be that bad. Look at this, who puts this in a McDonald's play place? This, is, this place is so weird, it's like if Burger King did satanic rituals and had, like, and their play place was like a Lovecraftian maze. It's really cool. I like I like this area. I'm leaving. I fell asleep in my car today after eating one of those burgers. I saw flashes of an animal lumbering towards me and something wailing from deep underground. But when I woke up, I was fine, but I had veered off the road. It could be allergic reaction or something worse, but this is my last day. And he was never heard from again. So yeah, it's like each hundred floors is like a different level of the background. I'm, I, I'll say it again, Spooky's House of Jump Scares predicted the, the backrooms type of horror. It was completely ahead of its time, because look how popular the backroom stuff is now. I can't find where to go. There's supposed to be a key here somewhere. I think there's supposed to be a key. Should we just go out? Oh no, there's more to it. There's the key. The monster should be coming soon. Oh, it's for the meat lock. Then he should be after. Whoa! He was in the room. There he is. Oh, he's fast. He's fast. <laughs> Fuck you, Satan! <laughs> no, 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 no! There was no way out. Now I'm in hell. God. This is why you don't eat McDonald's at 3 a.m. Shit. I'm, I'm dead. waiting for me. All I can do is walk towards him. With every bite you... with bone and skin, the top... I, I can't read that. Ugh. Spooker's home-cooked barbecue. Shit, 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 shit! Go! No, 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 no! Just run, just run. He's fast, he's fast. He's faster than the other monsters. What the hell? Oh! That's right! He makes the doors invisible! You son of a bitch. I forgot that he makes the doors invisible. I was like, I was like, there's no doors in this one. This guy sucks, dude. Oh, 
if I press rapidly around for a door, I'm gonna get sticky keys. Just gotta, at this point in the game, you've seen these rooms enough times that you kind of remember where a door would be placed. Okay, apparently not. Where's the... Yeah, the reason why it's never gonna run out is because you have no stamina now. You can swing your axe, but you can't run. That's oh, a deer guy. I literally can't run away from him. So now he's actually faster than me. Okay, this game is actually tricky. I saved, didn't I? Yeah, I did. Okay. All the monsters are faster than you, so you literally cannot stop and look at stuff. Well, at least I won't be rapidly pressing the sprint button, so I won't get the sticky keys shit happen again. She took away my sprint. It comes back after a while, after a few rooms. But it's really a slap in the face that she took away your sprint. And I can't believe I forgot that that guy makes the doors invisible. Like, this isn't like with Specimen 9 in the Endless Hallway where I was pretending like I didn't know what that was so I could showcase it. I actually did forget that he makes the doors invisible. I genuinely forgot about that. There we go, it's back. I was like, what was that sound? That was the sound of my stamina coming back. And the next dirty room should be calm. The two monsters that are next are actually pretty easy to deal with. As long as they don't throw a puppet man at me, this should be over sooner. It's looking like the water monster is next. So this is a reference to Amnesia. These blue walls make me think it's the water monster. So, you know, in Amnesia, there's the invisible monster that you can see where it is based on splashes in the water. And that thing is a pain in the ass. So there's a similar monster that's a parody of the thing from Amnesia in in this game. I think it's the next monster you fight. If not, it's the guy that's a parody of Clock Tower. Yeah, it's it's Clock Tower. This this part's really cool too. Mansion is strange. I think the bricks and wood are actually just painted on. Yeah, see because the texture doesn't line up right there. Or right there because you know it's flipped. If I'm pointing to the right side of the TV screen, it's gonna show me pointing to the left side because the webcam is flipped. That's it takes some getting used to. 
So Clock Tower is a really old game. We wander around a mansion that kind of looks like this, and there's a guy with big scissors that's wandering around. I actually don't remember where to go at this part. Am I just going in circles? Let's go up the stairs. You can't go up the stairs, okay. So these rooms kind of cycle around. Uh, I can hear him coming down the hall, I need to hide. What? Hi. Hi. I think he's outside the door now. Oh, now I can hide. Hide behind this box. Hide behind the box. Hide behind... Gives you a lot of time to hide. If you come out, he instantly kills you, I think. I don't even think you get, like, the blood scratch on your screen. I think he just instantly kills you. No, you don't. And that's all there is to that monster. I think you run from him after you get out of this room. Hey guys, so it's actually the next day. I wandered around aimlessly for like 10 minutes in this, in roommate 10. And you actually go up the stairs. I, I couldn't go up the stairs. I kept going, I can't go up the stairs. You actually go up them just just like going through doors. you got to press a button to go up the stairs. And my lazy ass couldn't, couldn't handle that. And here he comes again. Okay. Just going to chill out and wait. Lazy, who's coming? Somebody's coming! Somebody's coming to get me! Huh. I could get out and run, but I think he gets you immediately. I also did figure out how to edit videos, so I'm going to try not to make things be an hour long. And I dropped a key. So I managed to get away, I don't know if I want how I hear him, even though he's like he's not there. It's like he's my own fears manifesting inside me. I might be able to skip going to the wine cellar because the, you pick up the key right here. I like was looking for ages for the key. Please don't let me get lost in this place again. Okay, that's the sound of my dog snoring. I thought I thought the the dude was breathing down my neck in the game. Mm -hmm. Oh what? Don't I need to hide? I guess you just needed to do that one time. Well what was the key I picked up for? Gee, 
Are these doors not real? Or are they just are they just painted on? I've been in this room before. I think this is a locked room. There's gotta be a secret door somewhere. Oh. Now I can get into that room. Okay. Well, bitch, what is that key for? Okay, that is my dog, but it, it sounds like a monster in the game. But it's, it's just my dog snoring. <laughs> Okay, he drops a key here. I'm just I'm gonna go make a snack or something. Because he takes his sweet time to search the room. I'm gonna go make a snack. That's right, we don't have any snacks. Long pints of the snacks to find some old Halloween candy that should sustain me for now. Aren't you supposed to drop it there? Yeah. Okay, that's locked. That's the wine cellar. Can't go in there yet. I'm gonna be doing this for another 20 minutes. Oh. Looks like it's missing something. Picked up key. Which should go here? I'm just going around in a big circle. Oh. Okay. Good chill out. You don't see me. 
He can't see me, can he? this way, right? It's just a it's just a straight shot. I'm stupid. This is scary. Is he gonna be wandering around freely now? Cause I really don't want to have to do this room again if he is. This guy, if he actually is wandering around freely, he might be a little bit worse than Burger King Man, because he kills you in one hit, I think. That's why you gotta hide from him. Not so bad. No. Almost fell down the vent. You don't see shit. Just go away, please. Should be safe now. Exit key. I remember that's the sound he makes after you now. Oh fuck me, he's after me. Okay. We can just juke him out. Well, just juke some out. Dude, this is tense. I'm not in the mood. my webcam because I edited the first half of the video the first video and this is another video I noticed my webcam was covering the sprint oh stage stage right stage left it was covering the the health and stamina and we, we got away from them so I moved the webcam down over so you guys can see the health and stamina let's let's look at it no, we still can't look at him yet. I don't know why it doesn't... I don't know why it doesn't show him up in the cat DOS database. I guess you gotta get to room 900. Holy shit, we're at room 830. We're... Almost done with the game. All of YouTubers, please. I'm, I'm begging you. Give me a checkpoint. At no! No! No!
That does it. I'm ending this part. My video is long enough anyways. Or <clears throat> I'm going to get to room 900. And then I'll start recording part 4 of the final. This is God, the puppet guy. Every time, that's why I wanted to save at eight fifty. God.